Okay, so salutations all and welcome back to Basic Public Speaking. I'm making this midweek video to post up to kind of answer a few questions and get us in the mindset for us to start next, um, fully dive in next week. Now, I know you've done the check-in and you've watched the videos about and you've read over the syllabus. So what I really want to touch base on here is that we won't do a live class every week. I use quotation, sorry. We won't do a live class every single week, meaning you won't have to specifically meet at your class time. Now next week we are going to try this on Monday and I'm going to make a post here in a bit that will like, remind you of your meeting time. The class won't last the whole time. It's just really kind of for us to get our feet wet and to test it out. I believe I'm going to do, it's on Blackboard and it says collaborate, but I will double check and it'll be part of the instructions on how we access into this class during your meeting time. Like I said, we're not going to do a live class every week, but what will happen pretty much every week is that I will post videos. My goal is to have them posted by Monday morning and about be more of Monday afternoon, but Monday, <clears throat> all videos will be posted over any lessons that we're going over that week or any speeches that are due that, that week. I will post the specific requirements. Now, <clears throat> with speeches, your first speech is next week. Uh, I've already posted a video and I'll repost that video when you first log in the Blackboard so that it's right there to kind of give you that joke reminder. Um, I'll probably post that up during the weekend so you can get a little good look at it. This very first speech is a record and send speech. What do I mean by this? You will record it via your computer, iPad, phone, whatever your electronic device and recording capabilities that you have. And it's an introductory speech. I'm not going to go into the details of it because I already have a video on the introductory speech itself. But it's just a record and then you will either email it to me, upload it onto Blackboard and I'll have a, like, it's probably going to be in the discussion section that you can upload it. Or if technology fails us, you can always text it to me. But when it comes to speeches, I would prefer that texting be the last route that you take and that we try to upload to Blackboard and to email it just just for it's easier for me to keep it together but I will take a text I will take a text speech I won't be like no you can't do that because you know sometimes technology is not our friend so like I said this is just a reminder of how I'm running breaking down the class every week I will post videos now this this upcoming Monday which is the now this is me trying to figure out what, uh, the 26th, no, 24th, yes, so 7, 17, 24th, <laughs> Monday the 24th, we are going to try to meet in live time during your class, and I'm going to make a post about it, how we navigate to get to there, and it's just so we can chat kind of over the first sections of the book, which the first sections of the book is what I'm, I'm pretty just going to like sh quickly go over, you know, speech, the different genres of speech and um, the communication process. But again, at the beginning of every week, there will be posted videos of the lessons. The, the lessons are already posted and so are the PowerPoint presentations. And I have those up. At the beginning of each week, I will send a video that kind of goes into a little bit more depth of what I want to talk about out of that week or out of that lesson or what I want you to get out of that lesson. Any speech requirements that week or anything that's going on that week will also be posted at the beginning of the week. Now, when it comes to speeches, generally in class, it would take us a few weeks to go over one speech. I'm allotting three days for you to get your speech turned in. Usually, and I have all the dates posted, I posted a tentative class schedule of what we're going over and due date from now to the end of the semester. I'm, I try, I try to give at least two to three days that it's due and it's always at the end of the week, except on Thanksgiving week, but that's a mini speech. So it's not as, in, it's not as detailed or in, 
as the main speeches are. So your first speech is due next week. It's due, you can start to turn it in by Friday, between Friday and Sunday. I give you till like midnight, I think on, or 1130, I think is what I set the cutoff date for, for the date on Sunday night. But it gives you three days to get it turned in. It gives you all week to work on it and also the week to look over any videos or the requirements and stuff. I post at the beginning of the week what lessons we're going over, what lessons I want you to take away from what we're going over that week so that you can look at it in your leisurely time. I know that there's a lot of things going on. Well, I know Carter County Schools start virtually next week. And on top of that, you have other, you may be taking other college courses and you may have jobs or after school activities. You know, there's a whole slew of things. So you're not in such a time crunch. We will try live classes and I haven't quite decided on the rest of the speeches if they'll also be just a record and turn in or if we'll try them on a platform. There's a couple different things in the air. Like I said, public speaking completely online is new territory for us all and we're going to have some fun. <laughs> But I just wanted to make this really quick midweek video touching base with you that I am going to make a post as well. We're going to try a live class on Monday during your scheduled meeting time. I'll post how to navigate into that. I'll also make any po um, video posts that week and your first speech is due next week, which I will repost the requirements, the description of that speech and how we are going to go about it. So a reminder again, because I think I've said this a couple times in this video, how we're going to break down this course. At the beginning of each week, the lesson videos will be posted, um, all, all chapter reviews, learner lessons, and PowerPoint presentations have already been posted up for the entire year. They're located under different headers, and I'll tell you what headers to look under and what chapter, because some headers have multiple chapters that we're going to go over, like this very first the very first header has like four or five different chapters that we're going to cover in the first X amount of weeks while we're doing all this. I will also post videos for any speech requirements that week or any other or any of our due dates. Um, I have a tentative schedule posted and I believe I posted it under the syllabus header where you can find that information at. Uh, but I will always remind you of due dates and it, you probably get sick of hearing me remind you of due dates. But I just wanna do this quick midweek video. If you haven't checked in with me, do so. Um, again, the check-in is just, you know, let me know who you are, let me know you read over the syllabus, tell me how you can get in touch with me via email or my text messaging. Um, I can send emails through Blackboard but Blackboard messaging is down. I don't know how long it's going to be down. I don't know for sure. So if you've been trying to send your check-in via Blackboard messaging, you're probably not getting through. So you need to shoot an email or you need to shoot a text. Anyway, guys, that's kind of all I have for this midweek. Again, I'm also going to post along and then post what your specific class meeting times are so that there's no confusion. And we'll try, we'll try live on Monday. So I hope you all are having a fabulous first week with your classes and I will talk to you later. Have a wonderful day. Thank you so much. Bye.